Hey, it's Coach Ben from Online Soccer Skills, and in today's video, we're gonna be working on volleying the ball out of the air. Now, when I go watch players play, there's really two types of players out there. When a ball is being played in from a corner or across, there's a type of player who lets the ball, you know, kind of come towards them and they're waiting and they take maybe one or two, one, one to two, too many touches on the ball. And when that happens, the defenders are coming in and winning it. Now, when you have the ball that comes in off a cross or a corner, you could be the type of player who's looking to take it out of the air. And you could do that by volleying the ball or heading it. And in today's video, we're going to be working on volleying it. So when a ball's being you know, played in from a cross, I have to be able to judge the ball. And a lot of times when players are doing this, they're trying to volley a ball that's either too high when they should be heading it, or it's kind of too low and they're using the wrong technique. So today I want to talk about the technique and how you need to attack the ball. So the first thing that we got to do is get ourselves in the right position with our body. And when the ball is being played in from across, if there's a player who's about to cross the ball in right now, I need to put my chest towards the ball. And I don't want to be in the position where the ball is coming here across my body trying to score. That's a lot more difficult. So I need to have my chest towards the ball. And when it's being played in, I need to be able to hit a ball here with my laces. So that way, when the ball's coming in, I'm striking with my laces here. I'm coming across my body. And that way, when I make contact with the ball, it's going to stay kind of like in an even plane. And I need to make sure that I make the right contact with the ball. The common mistake I see that players make when they're trying to volley the ball is they're not hitting the center. They're either coming under, and when you come under, when you're trying to strike the ball across your body, it's just gonna go too, too far over the goal. So we wanna try to hit the middle. And a lot of times too, players are hitting the top of the ball. So they're hitting too high up on the ball and that's gonna create a bounce. And that's better than coming under the ball, but we wanna hit the sweet spot. And the sweet spot is right in the middle. So when we make contact with the ball, we're coming across our body and we're hitting with our laces the sweet spot. All right, the other thing I want you to think about is your body positioning when you strike the ball. So I need to have my non-kicking foot planted towards the goal when I do this. I don't want to plant my foot here if I'm trying to come across my body here. I need to plant my non-kicking foot. I need to kind of pivot my foot right before I kick the ball and that's going to put my body in a perfect position to be able to place the ball in the goal. And the other thing I have to do is when I make contact, I want to have my hips square with the goal. So when the ball is coming to me, I need to be able to judge it first. So I need to know where do I need to have my feet set up? Am I going to be attacking the ball or am I moving back a little bit to volley it? But you need to have your non-kicking foot planted towards the goal. As you rotate and you make contact with the ball, you want to hit that sweet spot. And remember, we want to hit the middle of the ball. All right, a good drill that you can do on your own is you can have the ball either at your feet and you can be juggling it, or you can have a ball here and toss the ball. And I want you to try to focus on the technique that we just talked about. So if you have a goal, that would be great. You could also do this just kicking against the wall, but we want to work on the technique. So I'm just going to be tossing the ball out in front of me and I'm going to be working on rotating, planting my non-kicking foot towards the goal or the target and working on hitting the sweet spot with my laces. And remember, you're coming across your body when you do this. All right, so when you go through this drill, I want you to practice with your strong foot and make sure when you're doing it, you're using the right technique. You know that you're hitting the sweet spot over and over again and it's something that's gonna become easier and easier. Now, after you do that, then you can go and practice with your weaker foot. And this is something that, you know, in the game on corners or crosses, you wanna be that type of player who's gonna go win the ball out of the air. And this is gonna be something that's gonna help you create more goal scoring opportunities for your team. As always, like, comment, or share this video. And if you're brand new to this channel, make sure and click that subscribe button below. That way you can stay updated with all the newest videos that get published. Also, if you're an elite player and you want to take your game to the next level, I want you to click this video right here. That's going to take you to a page. Just tell me what position you play, and I'm going to personally email you our highest level skills workout. If you're on any mobile device, you can't click that. So just go to, our, to the first link in the description. It's onlinesoccerskills.com slash free training. It's going to take you to the same page. All right, I'll see you next time.